So, I made a video earlier today where I talked about Yule Doche and the way he's claiming revenue on in his videos and voice, you understand? And um, I told you guys that it happened to me. I reacted to his video, of which that video, the video that I took from him was not up to one minute video. But I reacted, for, I reacted for like nine minutes. It was a 10 minute video. I only took one minute out of his own video, then now analyze it. And in analyzing it, I spent almost nine minutes analyzing one thing and saying other things, you understand me, concerning that particular video. Hmm? Then, immediately I posted it. The next thing, in the next few minutes, um, Facebook sent me a signal that Yul Edoche is collecting ads, ad revenue from that my video, which is this thing you're seeing here. He is collecting ad revenue from the video I made. I only collected 30 minutes video of his. Then now use my own 9 minutes plus do analysis on that video. But because of that, his 30 minutes video, 30 seconds of a 30 waiting video, he now decided to collect the whole revenue. Immediately, uh, they sent me that, that message. I deleted the video instantly and recreated it, removed his voice. Because that voice was the only thing that attracted that revenue. You get, I removed his voice. So now, he made another one yesterday where he was talking about married women. Men should not be dating married women and all that. I told people to be careful because I noticed that he liked to do such things so that people will be carrying that video. And the more you carry the video, the revenue will be going to him. You understand me? So this lady, why I'm trying to explain this thing to you now is because I noticed that you are not on social media. You do not even understand what we are doing. No man, me no send. I don't send anybody. I know they look Elizabeth face. But why I want to reply you is because I noticed that you maybe you are talking from the aspect of maybe conscience, the way you're seeing it. You do not understand the game we are playing here. Let, listen, let me tell you, nobody is hurting anybody. Nobody is, uh, is trying to spoil his own business. Rather, he's the one that is even trying to starve us on this internet. You understand me? Nobody is trying to spoil his business. Listen, let me tell you, we all are content creators. I, in particular, am a content creator. I create content on daily basis. In a day, I used to create more than five to six videos. Content, yes, on my own, with my strength, my mouth, my energy. You understand? So, if, after creating content, there are some of my content that I see people recreate post on their pages, you get, I have never go, gone there to claim their own revenue because they recreated my content. That's what we are talking about. I do videos, go to social media, you see people sharing my content, doing it, recreating it in a way it will look not exactly like original, but at least to the point that, uh, that, uh, that it will be accepted on the platform that they want to post it. So are you telling me that after you spend your own time your own energy, carrying my video. I know I'm the original owner of that video. Then you now reacted to my video. So reacting to my video now, I will now go and claim revenue of your strength, your strength. All your data, you do, the time you spent making that video, your, your money, you spent everything. First of all, you have to download my video before, because, before you start reacting to it. If you see my video that you like, you first of all, you download it. Then when you download, you now try to create, you have to be creative on how to analyze that my video, recreate it and make it look not exactly like the original so that so, uh, these people will accept it. Hmm? Then after doing all these things with your own data and your time, with the intention of picking something from that video, then after stressing yourself and doing all these things, then in the comfort of my home, I will just put one, one claim on that video that you spend your even though it is my own original video listen let me tell you it's not only one pe one person nobody have the monopoly of making videos though, that people can take i take people's videos people take my own videos too you understand me that's what we do here you i can see your video that i like i will take and react to it you can see my video that you like you take and react to it that will not give me the right to go and be claiming your revenue that is wickedness or oh, she it's wicked it's meanness you go just sit down for the comfort of your home. Come they eat revenue from someone's sweat. That's meanness. So you're telling me now that people, after taking my own video now, 
recreate it with their data, with their time, with their money, everything, and post it on their page. Then I will now sit down comfortably and be claiming revenue. That's madness. I want you to understand this. Because I know maybe you did not understand. You are beginning to sound as if someone is spoiling his business. Nobody is spoiling his business. Rather, he's even the one that wants to be starving us on social media. We all know what we are doing here. Are you getting it? On several occasions, you see people come out on social media to cry. Because people take their, 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 their videos and copyright it. The other day, is your way they cried bitterly against somebody that she said the person took her video and copyrighted it. She shouted and asked the person to release her video immediately or else that person will hear from her. In fact, she sent her account number to that person to pay her back because nothing concerning these people. As far as say that revenue don't go there, it don't go be that. So or it depends on, it's not between me and you. If you want to send the ad back to me, you can send it back to me. So she sh that was her own original content. They have done that to me on several occasions, but sometimes I don't want to talk. And they're too busy. Not the only this thing that they do, and they do other things. So, when such things happen, instead of me to come and be talking and be shouting, I will just delete that video to have peace. So that it will not damage my page. Are you getting me? So, that is the thing that he now waiting himself they do. Because of his voice, 30, 30 seconds voice, one minute voice of his video that you put. He will now claim everything, all your, all, like as I do video, as I talk like this, and this is a content now they create now. Person feel like this and that I'm doing now. The person wants to react to it. Now the person will download it and, and react to it in a way it will suit that person. The person will now put it on her page so that these people go monetize and give her small thing. Then me, I go just sit down like this. Go they claim revenue. You don't know you are you not getting where I'm coming from? I am taking my time to explain this thing to you because you don't understand the system. Now people wait there with us. That was why I said this video is specifically for bloggers. Content creators, people that understand what we are doing. That's meanness. That's wickedness. It's not good. We all, we, we they carry everybody's video for this social media. The other day, Senator Martins was crying that this man is, is, getting, is uh, taking ads, ad revenue from her video. And when you go to check that video, now 30 seconds, I'll be, you know, reach one minute video where person collects. You don't want to take the ad. So it is an awareness video I made. If you want to take his video, is that two things are involved? Is that you want to do charity for him, or you just want to entertain people? Because this whole thing now is a question of monkey the walk, baboon the chop. You go take your time, create your content, recreate it, do so many things, add video, remove, add with your data, with your money. It's not as if you are the only one that people carry your content. A lot of bloggers, a lot of people carry, what about people that do movies? People carry it and recreate it and post. Have they come to claim revenue? They have not. So, but because you just want to be mean, you know, it's to be claiming revenue, person go work finish. See, eh? Why I, why I alerted people is that I know most of these people are not the ones managing their, their pages. They don't know. There are certain things that their admin will not tell, tell them. Their admin might be very busy admin that will not understand that, oh, this particular video is not paying this person. This particular video, and they may send, they may send message, you will not see it. For your mind, you'll be like, oh, you are doing well. At the end of the day, when the results come, you will still say, you know, you know, pass anything. So it's an awareness video, my sister. Nobody is hurting anybody here. There's nothing religion about it. There's nothing Christianity about it. It's just everybody trying to safeguard, mount your guard, protect yourself, and protect your territory. If you want to do Saraka for person, you go clear your mind. No, say you want to do Saraka, you go do Saraka, give person. But if you don't want to do Saraka, you go, now say, you so, no, say that business you can't do for social media. Your eye go open. You know, go let the person, they chop you. Even though we are creating content, I can never go and claim anybody's revenue because you carried my video. That's meanness. Because of this thing, I understand the assignment. I have never copyrighted any of my videos. Oh, you can carry my video, react to it. I got no problem. Because I'm taking my own. I will not eat my own and eat your own. Now, he himself won't become one day, day greedy. But if people stop carrying his video, he will understand. You think it's easy for people to come and share your video and make you popular? No, no. Nah, now, nah, if you say, you know what, make people they carry your video, it's okay. People go abstain from your video. Only you go do your video, only you, then go watch them, they don't go share them, you go there like that. Before you know it's now, now you, you use her hand, now they do bad market for yourself. 
People should not be very selfish on this internet. I beg. 